a human being is an animal in one of you know obviously and has a lot in common with animals um, but there is this element of consciousness of language and of culture that distinguishes us from the animals I think I read the other day the two things which distinguish a human being from an animal are language um, verbal language and um, the uh, taboo on having sexual intercourse in public. Um, <laughs> uh, which, you know, is quite a, quite a convincing kind of criterion, actually. Um, so I leave uh, that, that, that's what, those are the two things. <laughs> that's what a human being is, an animal who has these two special features, language and uh, a certain need for privacy in, sexual intercourse, which also, of course, is not uh, related to any phase in the, light, in the cycle. I mean, it's all, all time. It's not, we're not on heat at particular seasons. So sexuality is deeply... Our, our, our attitude to sexuality, I think, is, uh, is very, very defining of humanity. And um, the fact that we know we're going to die and the whole structure of religious thought that's really based on that discovery, uh, those are things which make us human. <laughs>